Hi, my name is Adam and uh, this lab is determination of copper, cadmium and lead in drinking water using differential pulse anodic stripping voltometry. Uh, the device can be seen here. First thing you're going to want to do in this lab is remove the cell for analysis. It often contains a small amount of mercury so it is always uh, emptied into the mercury waste located on your bench. And to keep the electrodes from drying out, we always replace it with uh, deionized water. So at this point, you'll want to have your standard and your unknown made according to your lab manual. And you'll want to go ahead and start building your cell, uh, starting with 10 mils of deionized water. Then using your automatic pipettes, you'll want to add your one molar acetate buffer, uh, three molar potassium chloride, and your unknown to the cell. Once you have your cell built, you'll want to place it back into the instrument. And you'll want to start your run on the program. Uh, first you want to ensure that you have loaded the correct method. Uh, so if you go to file and load, select the uh, cadmium lead and copper in drinking water method and open and then click start. Continue. Here you'll want to uh, type in something that identifies yourself and your group and click OK. Uh, the instrument will go through a series of tests and then it will prompt you to inject the standard edition. At this point, you'll want to inject 100 microliters of your standard through the injection port located on the top of the instrument. So prepare your 100 microliters of your standard first. Then it will be injected through this port covered by this Teflon plug. Remove the plug. And you want to ensure that you inject the fluid directly into the cell without hitting the electrode or the glass wall. Replace the Teflon plug and click OK to continue. 